what's going on guys let's look at this problem right here this question is asking a series LRC circuit consists of an AC voltage source of amplitude 75 voltage and variable frequency a 12.5 microfarad capacitor a 5 millihenries inductor and a 35 ohm resistor the first question is asking to what angular frequency should the AC source be set so that the current amplitude has its largest value and here we had to know when will the maximum current occurs maximum current occurs at resonance and at resonance we know that omega is equal to 1 over square root of lc here the question is ang angular frequency that's the this is the equation for angular frequency at resonance and 1 over square root of lc l is inductance that is 5 millihenries so 5 times 10 to the power of minus 3 and C is capacitance that is given by 12.5 microfarad 12.5 times 10 to the power of minus 6 and if you calculate this one you will get 4000 and the unit is going to be radius radians per second okay so this is part A now let's look at part B under the conditions of part A what is the maximum current amplitude now we know that this happens at resonance and also at resonance XL, this is the uh, inductive re reactance is equal to capacitive reactance and if this is like this we know that uh, impedance impedance is going to be equal to resistance and here the resistance is provided that is 35 ohm so 35 ohm and to calculate the maximum current we use this equation V over impedance and V is 75 voltage divided by the impedance here the impedance is equal to resistance so we can plug this one right here so this is going to be 75 divided by 35 that's going to be equal to 2.14 ampere so this is part b now let's see part c suppose that the voltage source is set to twice the angular frequency needed in part a what will be the current amplitude in this case now we have the angular frequency set twice initially we had 4000 radians per second and if it's twice we are going to have 8000 radians per second so the question is asking what's going to be the current maximum uh, what what will be the current amplitude in this case to find that one we had to find the impedance to find the impedance we had to use this equation z is equal to square root of r square plus x cell minus xc square so this is the equation for impedance now let's plug the values r square is resistance square that's going to be 35 square and uh, xl is equal to omega l minus xc is going to be equal to 1 over omega c square now we know that new omega is 8000 so this is omega so we can plug that one instead of this so this is going to be 35 square plus omega is going to be 8000 times l is 5 millihenries 5 times 10 to the power minus 3 minus 1 over omega c omega is 8000 c is c is 12.5 microfarad so this is going to be 12.5 times 10 to the power minus 6 and all together square and if you calculate this one you will get z is equal to 46.1 ohm now we have the impedance now to find the current we had to use v over z i is equal to v over z and voltage is 75 voltage divided by the impedance that we found that is 46.1 ohm and if you divide this one by 46.1 you will get 1.627 and that's going to be the final answer for this question i hope this helps thanks for watching